Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of trailer explanation. In this video, we are going to cover unit summarize report data from the project evaluate report data with formulas. Now, as part of this unit's challenge, we will be working on the concept of summarized report data in our lightning reports. So we'll be seeing how we can calculate the sum and average of a specific field in our lightning reports. So the report that we are going to create will be on opportunity. So let's quickly launch your trailer playground and go to app launcher. Now here search for reports. We are going to create a new one. So click on that button and select or search opportunity from here. Click on start report. Now, the very first thing that we have to do is make data visible in our report. So for that, we have to change the filter. So there are two ways you can do that. Either set the close date filter to all time. You can directly click it from here, or you can go to your filters tab and select close date filter from here. And in the range, you have to just select all time. Click on apply and you will be able to see all the data here. Now, the next thing that we have to do is we have to group our opportunity records based on our stage name. So let's just go back here in the group section on outline tab, you have to select stage field, select this under opportunity information. So this will group our opportunity records based on stage and simultaneously it will show the count how many records are there under each stage. So if you see over here, prospecting for prospecting stage, there is one written in the brackets. So that means there is only one record which has prospecting stage. Similarly with qualification value proposition, but if you see here, ID decision makers, there are two records, namely edge emergency generator and grand hotel kitchen generator. So we have two records under this ID decision maker stage. So this is how we are grouping based on the stage that we have all the opportunity records. Moving ahead, we have to summarize amount and expected revenue column. So let's just go back again here, scroll towards right. Now you see over here, we have these two columns, amount and expected revenue. And both of these columns should display the sum as well as the average of the records. So let's see how we can do that. Against amount, there is this drop down. Select this summarize option. Click on sum. So now it shows us the sum. For the very first record, parameter emergency generator, we have only one record for prospecting stage. So the sum is, is one lakh only. But if you see for the two records under ID decision makers, there are two opportunities and the amount for each opportunity is 35,000 and 15,000 and the sum would be 50,000 altogether adding 35 and 15,000. So this is showing us the sum. Now we have to show the average as well for our amount column. So select this drop down again, summarize and click on average as well. Now you'll see average for each row in your report. So there is only one record. So this doesn't explain much of the concept, but if you see for the two records under ID decision maker, the sum is 50,000. If you add both of these numbers and average of 50,000 is 25,000. So this is this way it is working for amount. And this way we can summarize our data based on sum and average. Now, we have to apply the same for our expected revenue as well. So click on this drop down and select sum. So we'll be seeing the sum value here for the expected revenue for each record. And similarly, you have to select the average. So now we got the sum and average for each record. Now, the final thing is we have to save and run our report by the label opportunity by stage. So let's just copy this, go back to our report builder, click on save and run. Paste this label and nothing is mentioned about folder as specific. So we are keeping it private reports. So if you want, you can change the folder. Just click on save. So now our report is so ready. The only thing left is we have to verify our step. So let's just click on this button. There you go. This unit is completed. See you in the next video with another unit or module. Till then, take care. Thank you so much.